All right, guys. So on Pothole Surface today, we are going to build a. Uh, we're going to update, upgrade our um, bike trailer, and I'm going to show you how in a minute. Right now, we're off to a secret uh, location where uh, we're going to go clean up the neighborhood a little bit. I'll show you guys what we're up to in a second. All right, guys. So we're at our secret undisclosed location, about to pick up our uh, do some neighborhood cleanup. So what we're gonna do here, there is, um, as you can see out there, a shopping cart that's been left in distress. Shopping cart lives matter, okay? Shopping carts get lost every day from their store and they never make it back. They end up getting recycled. So we're gonna give this one some new hope. Let me get it in the van and I'll tell you about it. get out of here so shopping carts get lost from their stores every day this one's been sitting there for uh, since Sunday and they come to the Starbucks right here every day since Sunday and I've had an idea about something to do with a shopping cart but I haven't been able to realize it because I was missing the shopping cart but now that I got it we're gonna get started on this all right now trust me I know this looks shady all right and probably kind of is the shopping cart doesn't have any store markings on it so it, i can't even return it to the store if i wanted to all right it's been sitting there tomorrow's trash day chances are the trash guys are going to clean it up because that's their job so we're going to give it new hope let me get it home and i'll show you this new shiny unit and uh We'll take a look at the plan for today, for what it is, for what we're going to do with it. So, so here it is. Here's our unit. Look at this thing. It's already murdered out, so that's already cool. It's got child seats, seat belts, a cup holder. I mean, what's not to like about this thing? So the plan is we're going to take this and that which is seen it's better day it's pretty far gone and we're going to combine the two to make the ultimate yard sale clunker biker bike trailer thing i don't know it's gonna be pretty cool i'm pretty excited it's got a handle man the more i look at this the more it's gonna be awesome um so stay tuned let's get this project started let me show you what the plan is real quick all right guys so here's the plan we are going to chop the basket off this top part of the shopping cart and we're going to take the fabric off of this because it's already pretty bad and we're going to merge the two together which is going to be cool because we're going to have a pretty solid cart maybe to move things around the bottom part of this maybe i don't know i don't know what we're going to do with it but then um we're going to have the basket to put on there and it's going to be great. It's not, I mean, the kids love being in a shopping cart at the store. They're going to love being in a shopping cart behind a bike. I mean, I don't know. It's like a match made. So now I'm going to lay this cart down and cut the basket off. It looks like it's just welded in these two spots here. Should be pretty easy to separate the two. That's the only places where they're welded. And it seems like this is strong enough where might be able to clamp it just to smock it up and if that works it can stay that way not to mention this trailer is for portability reasons which is one of the downsides it's not going to be as portable as it was uh but you can narrow it down it has like um these bars that you can slide into each other so once we can even slide it and try to make it as narrow as possible i know it's not going to be as portable but it'll it'll work and technically you already have a seatbelt with your child so this is just gonna be amazing so let's get started
Alright, so as you just saw, we took apart the trailer there. Bare bones. Like I said, I can close this. If I pull, push those pins in, I can close it and shut it. We'll decide where we put it in a minute. But now, it's a moment of truth. We're going to be cutting off the shopping cart here. We're going to be cutting here at the welds. The bottom piece should stay intact. And it could be used for something else. I'm not sure what. But uh, it might be cool. Fits right in the basket. Very little overhang. I was kind of worried about that. Looks awesome. So now the next thing I'm gonna work on is attaching it. But before I attach it, I'm gonna use some zip ties and attach it to the frame just to make sure nothing's rubbing or nothing needs to change. So maybe take it around the block just to make sure nothing's gonna rub or anything the wrong way. And then after that, we can attach it permanently and I'll show you how I'm gonna do that. And hopefully, uh, That'll be it. And then we'll have an awesome shopping cart trailer. All right guys, so this is what the setup looks like. It is heavier than probably would have liked, but it works. And I'm gonna take it around the block. Right now it's just zip tied on. I just wanna see if it's gonna work. And then if it works, I'm gonna clamp it down. But for now, let's just see if it works. Alright, what are we gonna do girls? Mommy did the round block. What is this? Uh the, the bike with the shopping cart. Oh right? yeah. Right. Maddie, you good? Yeah. yeah. So at the end of the day, there's a the trailer. It's pretty cool. It's pretty heavy. I mean you can ride it with your bike, it's just pretty heavy, but I mean it's it looks awesome, right? It's a shopping cart. You go grocery shopping. You can fit all your groceries in there. Because, I mean, it's the size of the shopping cart. So, I mean, unless you are one of those people that carry around two shopping carts, you should be good. So, the weight, you know, kind of stinks. Lucky for me, went on Facebook Marketplace, picked up this thing. Super 73Z1. It's electric helps out a lot with the weight so um that's gonna wrap up our shopping cart tr bike trailer video hope you enjoyed it and um i don't know what do you want to see with this let me know in the comments i'm thinking of doing maybe a costco run with the super 73 and the um shopping cart trailer might be kind of cool just to see too can it be done right like how's this do on a longer ride Maybe that's one of the videos that's coming. Um, maybe take it to some yard sales. Let me know what you guys are thinking. I was even considering riding it over to the to Rosemont, to the flea market. It's about a 10 mile ride from here. This thing would be pushing the range on the Super 73, but maybe, probably soon, we're going to be doing some videos with this. Maybe adding a second battery, adding some range. Lots of ideas. Got to put them all to work, though. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. A lot of more bike cotton coming your way. I also got a lot of videos to finish up on the um, on the Jeep. 
Um, as you can see, it's got different wheels, it's got a roof rack and the soft top. So a lot of different things happen with this. Um, people were really watching the videos, and to be honest, it's fine. There's like a million Jeep videos on YouTube, so I figured it would be better just to focus on other weirder stuff that I like doing, like the shopping cart trailer, which is awesome. All right, guys, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Thanks for sticking around.